Hellman. And I'm Melvin. And today we're going to review She's Out of My League. That's Bridget. Wait, playing in the water. We're, um, where are we at? We're at Sparks Lake. Sparks Lake. And yesterday we tried to climb that, that, that mountain. South Sister. We came with this our close friend. to reaching the summit. We came some, I don't know how far we But we were the first ones down the mountain. We were the first ones back. We, we succeeded in our own minds. Yeah. Uh -huh. A little scared, yeah. but I'm happy knowing that I got James with me. It's always nice to have a robot uh, yeah. nearby. That's true. I've never had one nearby me. But <laughs> no one wants to get by you. No, but I don't know any other robots. <laughs> I got the totally suck in post. There we go. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing this if I look like Oh, that's, kill that's a good shot. I almost had to save Robot's life. Twice. Twice. <laughs> And he pooped over there and left his paper. But I almost had to save Ed's life three times. Robot took <laughs> a poop on the hill and left his toilet paper no, over I there. No, he didn't. He's gonna be ashamed of himself. Wait, hold on. Hey. I saved you from a mosquito, uh, sucking all your blood. Now we're tied. <laughs> Is it dead? No. I, I've only left on for like 10 or 15 minutes. I'm okay. <laughs> what do you think? Top of the world, Ma. Huh. We're on our way back down. What do you think Bridget thinks? Bridget, are you tired? What do you think of she's out of my league? We think this is our friends. We might die out here. <laughs> we don't have any water. And we're exhausted. We so, if we do die, we loved y'all. <laughs> Thanks for the time. I don't know if I can make it down this hill. It's too steep for me. Without falling. Getting another scar. I didn't plan on this. I'm not good at steep hills. Shit. We just found the creek and water, so... We're not gonna... I was just telling them we just found the creek and water, so we're probably not gonna dehydrate anymore. We might not dehydrate. Yeah. Looks like we might make it, but cross the fingers. Alright. Um, just saying hi, if this is my last message. Wasn't that, life wasn't that bad. <laughs> Got to stand next to a creek on a mountain and make movies, so. <laughs> We, um, we think this is the right way. Record? Yeah. So, we think we're on the path back. The way we came is the creek where um, we got water from earlier. Bridget has survived. She's led us back to safety. <laughs> she was our Sherpa because Dave ditched us. <laughs> yeah. Dave did abandon us in our time of need. <laughs> And he should be very, very ashamed of himself. <laughs> he not only let us down, but he let Bridget down. And yeah, because Bridget shouldn't have to have that responsibility. That's yeah. Too much for a dog. Can you it tell us so what? Hot up there. Can uh, you tell us what Bridget is saying? She said, "I'm glad I got you guys back here." <laughs> <laughs> she says, "I'm feeling a sigh of relief now." <laughs> Well, we think we were wrong. <laughs> we were at the wrong stream. I think it might be over that way. Hey. We found some other survivors. So we know we're not the only ones out here. We're probably close to home. And we probably won't die. <laughs> so. We are thinking about going and stealing their car. equipment and car. Because when we get back, it's going to be at least another two hours before the rest of our group gets back, and we're locked out of our cars. 
the cars. So we're going to have to walk back to the camp. <laughs> Although we don't know we're hungry. how to get there. We don't, know, we don't have any food with. But we have yeah. confidence since we yeah. didn't know how to get down the mountain as well. Yeah. We still so made it. We're good at finding water. We still found way. water. That right there is beauty. But you know what overpowers that? Erica. So we think we're almost back. And uh, you remember walking by this waterfall. So it uh, couldn't be too much longer. Some may say that we didn't succeed because we didn't reach the top. Although we did come very close. Yeah. But you know what we did do? We succeeded because we reached the bottom first. <laughs> That's all that matters. So, in the end, who really succeeded? <laughs> I would have to say Hellman and Melvin. <laughs> and you know how we and did Bridget. it? And Bridget, of course. <laughs> Bridget! Bridget? There she is. Hey, Bridget. How are you doing? We think we're almost back to camp, if this is the right road. We found it, the campsite. Uh. <laughs> uh, salvation. What an adventure. Anyway, the movie. She's out of my league. What did you think? I thought it was uh, one of those one of those rare movies where uh, it, I actually laughed from beginning all the way to the end. I thought it was uh, it was a good movie as far as comedies go. I thought it was pretty funny. I could really relate to the. I agree with the in main many character. many ways. You uh, you are shy, kind of a pussy. You let women take control of you, and. Uh, you're basically a, uh, what was that term they used in the movie? They used for a male... A moodle? Yeah, you're a moodle. I thought you were going to say a five. No, you're, you're more like a three and a half. But you're definitely a moodle. Erica said I was a seven. No, uh, Erica lied. Yeah. She told me later that She's, you were a two and a half. Well, I increased it to three and a half. She said she told me the truth. It's the same two writers that wrote Hot Tub Time Machine and okay, Sex Drive. And sex drive, and um, I think they're like the next Jet Up to Kevin Smith, kind of similar comedy drama style. Um, there were a lot of scenes in it I thought that were a little risky for a comedy movie. Where, it's a rated uh, R comedy movie. Yeah. Well, yeah, but I mean, I've never seen that kind of comedy where you know there were certain Prejudice. parts of it that. Prejudice in the trans. Oh, you're a big spoiler. It's in the commercial. Oh, uh, what about the guy shaving his balls? Um, Is that a spoiler? That's a spoiler. Uh, sorry, go on. Uh, but uh, in terms of rating on the movie, I gave it four point five. I'd give it a 4.5 as well. Really? Yeah, I think it's the best comedy I've seen uh, this year, definitely. Eric, and best Eric. comedy I've seen since uh, The Hangover. Yeah? I wouldn't go that far, but it was one of my favorites. Well, you do not go I'd very tip. far at all because you didn't even make it up the mountain. Neither did you. What do you give The Hike? The Hike? Yeah. I give it a, a, uh, a 6. It was above a 5 because it was so extreme.